What's going on, Sacktown? Sacktown Pete, back at it again. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Happy Friday to everybody. Colin Coward, man, uh, comes on the other day to say that the Sacramento Kings should move to Vegas. Colin, what? Honestly speaking, like the national media, there's a bunch of casuals there, and uh, Colin is no different. He's one of the casuals. Have you ever been to Sacramento? Have you been here recently, Colin? Or have you ever been to Sacramento? Colin, you probably think the Sacramento Kings still play at Arco Arena. You probably still think the coach is Rick Gattleman. And you probably still think Jeff Petrie is the general manager. Listen, Colin, you and the national media or any of the casuals will never understand what the Kings and their fan base went through and what we did to keep our beloved team here in Sacramento. The Sacramento Kings play in the most uh, – Beautiful, state-of-the-art basketball NBA arena in the league. And it's located in downtown Sacramento. And that is the Golden One Center. Colin, the Sacramento Kings are going nowhere. Sacramento will always be home to the Sacramento Kings forever. Uh, free agents don't want to come here. That's not true. We've built well through the draft. We've traded some traded for some very well player, good players. And we have signed good free agents here in our market, knowing that our taxes and our California state taxes are ridiculous. We still managed to find talent and we still managed to get talent here. The fact that you've come out and said that the Kings should move to Vegas, not knowing that the Kings are not impending anymore relocation wise, we're here to stay forever and ever. And the fact that you've come out and said that free agents don't want to come here. Colin, that's not true. Free agents do want to come here. Free agents will continue to come here because the Sacramento Kings, despite their on-the-court dysfunction and changes of regimes, this regime that we have in place right now, they're for real. They're the real deal. And the Sacramento Kings this season will be a very good basketball team. You just watch, Colin. You just see. You just wait until you see the Sacramento Kings this season. And I can guarantee you, Colin, the players are aware of what you've said. Uh, most of our staff and coaches are aware of what you said, and uh, we're gonna use that as few. We're gonna use that as motivation. You know, we're all fuming. Our fan base is fuming. Um, you clearly do not know what you're talking about, and uh, you're basically uh, a uneducated idiot for saying what you said. So. Uh, I'm looking forward to seeing the Sacramento Kings prove you wrong this season, Colin. And, boy, we will get the last laugh, and I can't wait for that. So, with that being said, guys, let me know your guys' thoughts on Colin Coward and what he said regarding to the Sacramento Kings. Uh, really makes me mad, pisses me off. I try not to let, to, uh, let these things get to me. I tone it out. I ignore it. But at times, being very silent, I had to speak up and I had to say and chime in because – it does bother me the fact that when it comes to the relocation talks and having the Kings still, there's still people out there thinking that the Kings should move to Vegas or expansion city. Uh, they don't know the turmoil, the frustration, the sleepless nights that me and other fans and you guys went through when we went through it with the relocation rumors with Seattle and Anaheim and Virginia Beach. So... It does get to me, and uh, I just felt like I had to come out here and make this video because this is not okay. And until the Sacramento Kings do not become a winning team, this will continue. But that will change, and I'm very confident the Sacramento Kings are going to change that narrative this season. And I'm looking forward to it, man. So with that being said, guys, tone all that out. Ignore all the, social, ignore all the things you see on social media. Ignore the national media and ignore this guy in particular and Colin Coward, uh, who does not know what he's clearly talking about or what he's on about. So, with that being said, I'm looking forward to Sunday's game against the Portland Trailblazers. It's a preseason game. It's a home game. Uh, let me know if you guys are attending. Uh, if you guys follow me on Twitter, hit me up at Sacktown Pete. Let me know if you guys are attending on, attending on Twitter. Uh, I won't be at the game this Sunday. Uh, knowing that's a preseason home game, I would love to be there, but I'm, I won't be there. I will be there opening night, uh, first game against the Portland Trailblazers, and uh, there could be a good chance where I'll probably attend uh, next Friday's game, last season pre last preseason game against the Lakers. So with that being said, guys, 
that's going to do it for me for today's video. Thank you so much for tuning in. Uh, if you're new to my channel, welcome to my channel. Please hit the like and subscribe. I'll greatly appreciate it. Smash that like button and share with a few buddies and family. So I will catch you guys in my next video. You guys take care. God bless. Keep pushing forward. Have a great rest of your Friday, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.